What's up guys, Charles here with D2IPDesigns.com and I'm bringing you another tutorial. Today is going to be a Cinema 4D tutorial and uh, we're going to go ahead and just get right get right into it, get started. Um, I don't even know if I should consider this a tutorial, it's more of just quick tips. Um, anyway, so we have a pretty basic scene set up here. I'll just run out, render out a small portion. And as you can see, we've got the uh, text reflecting on the floor and um, but the other problem is, is the softbox is also being reflected on the floor, and we just want the text. So what we can do is um, we can come over to the softbox, um, and normally you'd right-click on it, Cinema 4D Tags, and then choose Compositing. But uh, since these are softboxes that I've customized and everything, I've already got everything set up. So I'll just open it up here, and um, here's the Compositing tag I have. We're just going to drag the floor in. And then we'll open up this softbox here, and again we'll drag the floor in. And now neither one of these softboxes are going to be reflective on the floor, or the floor is not going to reflect any of the softboxes. See? So now we just have the text. Um, another thing that's helpful is, uh, I know it's happened to me a few times, and it's irritating. Um, you have a camera set up exactly where you want it, and then instead of getting out of the camera, and moving around your scene. You stay in the camera and move around and then you know your camera placements messed up and you gotta fix it and everything. Well simple solution to that in case you forget to you know get out of the camera is right click on the camera, Cinema 4D tags and then protection. As you can see keeps you from moving the camera around. So simple solution for that. And uh, I think that's pretty much it. I just want to give you a couple little quick tips that some beginners might find helpful. And uh, I'm out of here.